out there on the floor tonight. Yeah, you know, like we see every year, these young guys are super excited to be playing in this game, and that excitement comes out onto the court. The Elites leading by eight. Hardaway, he's in a point guard. He's out there with Russell, and it's Okafor in at the five. That's Billy Donovan's five as we get going here in the second half. Back to Hardaway. Shoots off the screen. That's good on the jump shot. Hardaway has got the opening bucket to start the second half for the Elites. Timely passing leads to assists, and that's been the recipe for success. Everybody on the same page, completely in sync. Tremendous communication and awareness. Passes it to Ray. For the three. And he gets it to go. He's got six. The D just sagged off just enough and no hesitation on his part. Hardaway kicks to Russell. And it's good assisting on the play with Hardaway. Seven points for D'Angelo Russell. And how about that? Responding to the three-pointer against them with a quick one of their own. Terrific little tay to tay going on right now. Back and forth. Here we go. And that'll increase their rebound advantage. They've definitely been winning that battle on the board. You know what? No rebounds, no rings, and they've controlled the boards, and that's what's given them control of this game. And the Stars have possession. A 12-point game. Ray the pass to Anderson. Kicks it to Booker. Back to Anderson. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle on a lot of contact there. The Stars have shot 70% from the free throw line tonight. Seven for 10. That free throw good from Anderson. And both free throws good for Anderson. Hardaway with it. He's got 13. There's the double team with Roy. Over to the left wing. Hardaway dishes to Russell. Back to Hardaway. And he dunks it down. And what a beautiful way to polish off that sequence. Just strong at attacking the rim. That just puts a little more momentum on their side, don't you think? Absolutely. The defense got to tighten up now. I mean, you can't have the opposing point guard throwing down on you like that. They set the pick from 13. And the shot no good, a bit short. The elites leading by 12. To the wing on the left. To the wing on the left. The drive by Russell. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. The elites have gone three of four at the free throw line tonight. And he can't get the first one. Alexander's checked in for the Elites. The Stars also with the sub. Towns has checked in. That one is no good. The Stars trail by 12. Roy kicks to Booker. Back to Roy. Towns sets the pick for Roy. The feed now to Booker. Four on the shot clock. The Stars need to get off a shot. That's one for their first four to start the second half. Now Hardaway, he's got 15. Shoots off the screen. That's good on the jump shot. Hardaway has got six in the quarter. Effective screen set there for the jump shot. That was the key to the play. Substitutions here. Substitution. The Stars trail by 11. Fourth quarter on the court for the Stars. We've got Johnson. Booker out there with Anderson. 
And it's Cherry in at the two spot. And that one's good. And it's the Elites with the ball. They've led by as many as 14 points. Hardaway passes to Okafor. Right side, Hardaway. And stolen by Booker. Get back, get back. Here's Anderson. Can't get it to go. Now the Elites take it the other way. Russell passes to Welch. Here's Hardaway. He dents the rim with a two-handed slam. Wow. And how about a little bit of showmanship there as he increases the lead? Oh, I like that. That's got to be, though, a tough pill for the defense to swallow. Well, he's a guy that you know can hurt you with his passing, and right there, he does some damage with his finishing, too. Out to the right wing. Johnson the screen. Clock at six. Here's Lampley, and it's off the back rim, no good. Plus eight in the rebound differential, one more reason why they're in control. Yeah, double-digit advantage on the scoreboard. Uh, they've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more purpose so far. Picked by Okafor. Hardaway kicks to Okafor. The elites need to get off a shot. It's Hardaway that time on the assist by Okafor. And that's now 21 points for Freak. The Stars trail by 13. Clark, some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, they need a basket just to regain some momentum here, Kevin. Booker. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. Perfect screen there. Set him up with a terrific look. Yeah, I like the fact that the setup was good, the screen was solid, but you also have to look at the fact that the defender didn't do his job as well as he could have. And really, just a lack of awareness on his part. Just no idea he was right near the line. Ray. Here's Booker. Anderson outside. Pass to Ray. There's a good screen. And Roy, here we go. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it three. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Elites. Fantastic passing. We saw it in the first half, and it's carried over here in the second. The ball. They haven't the wasted time getting the ball up the court tonight either, and it's resulted in a lot of fast break points. Okafor dishes to Hardaway. Feeds to Russell. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. Free throw good, Russell. For your release, D'Angelo Russell taking two shots. And so Russell hits them both. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Ray the pass to Anderson. It's rebounded by the elites. Hardaway has got seven rebounds in the game. Yeah, it's been about the rebounding. Really, that's the dividing line in this game. Yep, and they've simply shown more aggressiveness, guys. More desire to secure the ball. Out left to the wing. No one near him. And that one's good. And the elites lead by 12. And for this young man, this game is serving as kind of a coming out party, if you will. A lot of fans haven't seen him that often during the regular season. And that's one of the neat things about the Rising Stars Challenge. It's a way for some talented young players to get their first taste of the national spotlight. I want you to focus on getting to the rim. Let's look to attack quickly. We need high percentage shots. Let's go all quickly around. over to Doris Burke for an update. Well, over the break, I listened in on Billy Donovan's... that offensively, they attack the basket at every opportunity. He also told them that he wants to see multiple passes on every possession. He said that was the key to getting the best shot each time down. So coach waiting until the final stages to pull a few tricks out of his sleeve. Kevin, let's see if he's made a wise decision. Thanks, Doris. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Out to the, the wing, picked by Okafor. Back to Hardaway, from outside the arc. 
rebounded by the Stars. And still looking for his first triple of the second half. He had three at halftime. And there's the pass to Ray. Here's Anderson. Rebounded by Hardaway. Hardaway has got eight rebounds in this game. And the shots just continue to say no in terms of falling. The Stars trail by 10. Here's Lampley. Nice shot from the wing. Now here is Hardaway. He dishes it to Okafor from 11 feet away. And he wills that one in, sinking right through off the back iron. You know, I know his NBA career is, is just starting out, but he has been logging some veteran minutes in the regular season. Well, in a short time, we're starting to feel from deep. Let's tighten up our pressure on the perimeter and make those looks tougher to get. We're going to give up the drive. We have to rotate on the weak side to get there. A minute 42 left to play here in the fourth. They set the pick to the middle, up off the screen. And he sinks the layup. The defense has not been able to keep the ball out of the paint at that end of the floor. And I'd be interested to know just how many of these attempts have come from inside of five feet. And there's the whistle, fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. Yeah, the defender all over. Greg, he got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. Gary Mobley. At the line for two. Good on the first, and that will put them up by nine. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Dishes it to Booker. He feeds it to Anderson. Rebounded by Hardaway. Hardaway has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Here's Russell. Yes, and it's Hardaway picking up the assist. 13 points for D'Angelo Russell. And if you thought this game was over already, you're probably right. <laughs> yeah, I would agree. I mean, it's staring us right in the face, and we've been around long enough to know when a game is over, and this one is in that category. Physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. That plus 10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. Yeah, not to mention what it says on the scoreboard. They're really pushing them around. Straight bully ball. And they're not finished just yet. They're going to make sure about this win. Yeah, not taking any chances, Greg. This is how you close a game out. Textbook. Anderson a screen on Russell. He used that pick to perfection. Yeah. Oof, that is a tough shot. Here's Hardaway. This game looks like they've got it just about wrapped up. You're exactly right. I mean, take care of the ball, work the clock. It's a wrap. Yep, nice game. Almost uncontested. I mean, it's nice to be able to add to the lead without having to really work for it. Anderson outside. That's the wall. Anderson can't get that one to fall. To the left side wing. Outside Hardaway. Goes up on the high post. That's good. An open jump shot there, and their D not putting up any resistance today. 